Aloha from Maui. This is Lady Ninari, Princess of the Sea, coming to you from the amazing Ace of Cups. Come check out the witchy wares. Ooh, I love those brooms. Check out all of the crystals and amazing things that Nicole has here in the shop. And for this week, I am featuring the deck, which is so cool. I mean, check these cards out. Gold and black. I love them. And it is called the Soul Whispers deck. Absolutely love it. So the cards that I came up with and pulled for everyone are show up as your highest self. So rather than your highest self, um, higher and lower is kind of like an earthly thing. So um, the Akasha through the Tarot is about moving into your soul. Show up as your soul and your soul light. And the reason that I was called to this deck is if you kind of look at the back of the deck here or um, the face card, the card that's on the uh, each one is basically the moon, right? So we are moving into the quarter moon. And what do we do after the new moon where we plant the seeds? Look at this, the card that came up. Water your seeds of your intentions, I. So the soul agreements that you have um, come into nurturing those soul agreements now between now and the full moon and check this out so the card here show up as your highest self or your soul uh, which seems to be kind of like vibrating I mean kind of look at that as it's doing that the the rays I'm not doing that that's kind of just doing that on its own and um, that's number 31 31 is the four, which is the diamond essence of Lemuria. And then we have the 24, which equals six, or the Merkaba, or Merkaba energy. So let's see what the top and the bottom of the deck have to share. So we have promise to love yourself fully. So self-love is more than just kind of like pampering yourself. This is about actually doing some soul gazing in the mirror and sharing with your soul with yourself your highest self being in your highest self honoring yourself and who you are and letting go of those things that no longer serve you i am sorry for anyone who has ever hurt you it's okay to be who you are you matter all right so then the bottom of the deck look at that okay you are safe to make mistakes. You are safe to be imperfect. You are safe, which kind of mirrors the card um, that I pulled for everyone last Friday from my deck, um, being in that place of being safe. So you have the number, look at that, 33, ascended master number, and another ascended master number, the number 11. So the wisdom through the Akasha is move into your soul and its light. Remember you are safe, you are protected, you are loved. By source, promise to love yourself as source loves you. And within your soul agreement, nurture those seeds of your inspirations from source. Much aloha from Maui.